Narcissists don't want empaths to know this or anything else. Hello, seekers of truth. Today, we're peeling back the layers of the complex narrative that is the narcissist-empath dynamic. While much has been said about the intricate dance between these two archetypes, what if I told you there are secrets the narcissists have desperately tried to conceal from empaths throughout this entangled tale? Yes, my friends, the narcissists have woven a web of deception, aiming to keep empaths in the dark, all in the pursuit of safeguarding their fragile existence. Before we dive into the depths of these hidden truths, make sure to hit that like button if you're ready to uncover the secrets, subscribe to our channel for a regular dose of enlightenment, ring the notification bell to stay in the loop, and share your insights with us in the comments below. Your engagement fuels the strength of our community. Stay with me as we unravel the 10 things narcissists desperately wish to keep hidden from empaths. The truth, once exposed, can be a powerful catalyst for transformation. Let's embark on this journey of revelation together. 1. They're helpless without empaths. Narcissists won't admit it, but they feel lost and powerless when not in control. They keep their insecurities hidden, fearing empaths might realize their vulnerability. Narcissists play dirty, but keep the battleground clean to maintain stability. They avoid empowering empaths, knowing the potential for retaliation. If empaths discover their true power over narcissists, the tables could turn. 2. Empaths are just a supply for narcissists. Narcissists lack genuine love and view empaths as mere sources of entertainment and sustenance. When empaths leave, Narcissists feel empty until a new source arrives. Narcissists see empaths as disposable objects meant to fulfill their needs. They justify cheating and disrespect, thinking empaths should be privileged to be with them. However, once empaths regain power, narcissists may desperately want them back, realizing the mistreatment. 3. They're perpetual hypocrites. Narcissists will forever be hypocritical but won't admit their flaws. They use empaths' words against them, distorting facts skillfully. Narcissists make empaths accountable for things they didn't do, manipulating trust through gaslighting. They project a false image, living a life of contradictions. Despite their hypocrisy, they shield themselves from being exposed. 4. Fear of empaths finding someone better. Narcissists confine empaths to prevent comparisons and fear losing them to someone better. They want empaths to believe only they can bring happiness or misery. This mindset harms empaths, making them think their narcissistic partner is the sole source of light in their life. Narcissists dread the idea of someone else bringing joy to empaths, fearing abandonment and misery. 5. Hopelessness within Narcissists Narcissists convince empaths they can change for a healthier relationship. However, they conceal their emptiness and hopelessness. Narcissists rely on empaths for their selfish needs, hiding the reality that life without them is miserable. They project a false sense of hope to keep empaths hooked, ensuring a continuous supply. The truth remains hidden to maintain the facade of a functional relationship. 6. They're empty inside. Narcissists live in a hollow world. There's nothing genuine or authentic about them. They lack a true self and only thrive on external validation. As an empath, it's crucial to understand that a narcissist's words carry no weight. You can't rely on them for honesty or sincerity. Narcissists believe they can say anything without consequences and they're accustomed to being tolerated. They feel entitled to speak freely, change their words, or deny what they said. Remember, narcissists evade accountability for their actions, including their words. 7. Empaths can never be enough for them. Narcissists won't admit, I'll accuse you of everything I'm guilty of for the rest of your life. They want empaths to grasp the limitless nature of their demands. They won't reveal the potential misery of a lifelong commitment, intending to keep empaths tied to them until their energy is drained. No matter how much an empath sacrifices, it won't be sufficient to make the narcissist genuinely happy. A narcissist's emptiness, selfishness, cold-heartedness, and delusion are innate, and it's not the empath's responsibility to fix them. 8. 
fragile egos. Narcissists project an image of superiority, expecting empaths to believe they're smarter, more spiritual, intelligent, and dominant. However, empaths are aware of their fragile self-esteem. Despite hoping for positive change, empaths keep this knowledge to themselves. Narcissists need to maintain dominance to continue receiving ego-boosting praise from empaths. Confronting a narcissist about their fragile ego might not lead to a productive conversation. 9. Incapable of genuine love and commitment. Narcissists only want to keep empaths interested and maintain control. They create a narrative where empaths should feel fortunate to be with them, but it's built on lies. Narcissists fear both commitment and abandonment, making relationships with them toxic. Empaths may find being with a narcissist emotionally draining, like ingesting poison, as genuine love is absent. 10. An empath's happiness lies outside the relationship. Narcissists don't want empaths to realize that a happier life awaits them beyond the toxic relationship. They conceal this truth to retain control over the empath's life. Narcissists thrive on being the center of their codependent's world, resisting any notion of happiness outside the relationship. The goal is to tether empaths to their happiness, granting the narcissist control over their thoughts, self-perception, and worldview. Recognizing the potential for happiness without the narcissist is a powerful realization for empaths. Hey there, empathic explorers. Delving into the intricate world of narcissists and empaths can be eye-opening, right? The truth is, narcissists often struggle to change because they can't confront the darkness within themselves. It's like they've tied themselves up in knots of codependency. Now the big question, are empaths truly blind to these harsh realities? Let's keep this conversation going. Share your thoughts and experiences in the comments below. Your insights might just be the beacon someone else needs. And guess what? We've got a free book that digs deeper into these dynamics. Check the link in the description to grab your copy. It's our little gift to you. If you're craving more personalized guidance, don't forget about our one-on-one -on -one consultations. Your journey is unique, and we're here to support you every step of the way. Thanks for being part of this incredible community. Your wisdom and experiences enrich us all. Until our next exploration, stay enlightened.